and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. Hi folks, I'm Bob Schub, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. Together we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. And our opinion, of course, Bob. I feel like that on Green Acres, remember that? Dun, 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 dun. We could get a pitchfork in here. Okay, talk. we're going to talk about today the undisputed number one butt shaping and strengthening exercise. This is glute training by a world expert. I think Ooh. this guy qualifies because uh, I saw this book and it was a it was a Wall Street Journal bestseller. I'm like, well, I, it's called the Glute Lab. And I thought this is going to be, it's, you know, the art and science of strength and physique training. So I thought it was going to be a lot of exercises right. for, for the whole body. Sure. Know? But no. This is about glutes. This is about your butt. Yeah. And this is 600 pages. And this guy did his PhD. His name is, let me get it right, Brett Contreras. Oh, yeah. So he's the glute guy. His middle name is probably glute. So, yeah. <laughs> Just so, kidding. So he invented this exercise, he believes. There's other people <laughs> that claim they did, but he says there's no documentation that they did. Ah, sure. So he's, he's the first one that came up with this. It's interesting, Brad. I saw this. My son sent me a, a picture of him doing this. Yeah. Uh, it was like a couple of years ago. Like, What's he doing? Yeah. I like, and then he was saying he was doing as much weight as The Rock was doing. You know, The Rock, the oh. actor? Yeah. So. Yeah, the I, guy with the bald head. Yeah, yeah. Was, Is he bald or? Yeah. Mostly bald. Well, he's shaved, I believe. Yeah, whatever. Oh. Okay, so he, we're going to go to this exercise. It's basically uh, called hip uh, barbell hip thrust. Okay. But you can do it different ways with resistance too. You can do it. Um, he does it off of a bench. There's also also a piece of machinery made for it now. Sure. Right. Um, um, but we can also, we're going to show you ways to do this on your own at home. Right. You know, maybe using a barbell or brands. Bob, I don't want to interrupt. Oh, by the way, if we're new to <laughs> you're new to this channel. <laughs> Sorry by about the way, that. good thing I was getting on a roll here. I know it. By the way, if you're new to our channel, please take a second to subscribe to us. Please, please go to <laughs> Not <laughs> throw me off. We're going to go to bobandbrad.com because we're always giving something away. Go to the uh, giveaway section. That's right. It'll also be at Facebook. It'll be pinned to the top of the page. Top of the page. And we'll talk about what we're giving away in oh, just a second. Yep. Uh, uh, go to Instagram or Twitter or TikTok for a 60-second version of our program. That's right. We are giving away <coughs> Excuse me, a Thermatex Far Infrared Heating System. This is awesome. Yeah. So this is just, you know, penetrates much deeper than regular heat. It goes 2.36 inches. That's right. And uh, it works well for almost the entire your body. Back, I mean, you your can, knee, your yeah. knee, your hip, ankle. It's really a good one for the back. Yeah. Because you put it in your chair and you just, every night you flip it on mm. and you get that basically a treatment. So. All right, Bob. All right, let's, let's go. On. All right. So as I was saying. Uh, he invented this, and there's a lot of different ways to do it. I'm going to show you first the barbell way. Now, this, I am not an expert at this by any means, Brad. Yeah. I, I just, what he had in the book. So, basically, he takes a full barbell with a 45-pound barbell. Yep. And you bring, might start with just a barbell because you've never done this before. And he lifts it up, and he sits down on the bench. Yep. Now Brad's going to hold this bench because you got to, if you have a bench, you got to make sure it's secured up against the wall or somehow it's secured. A good solid bench. Yeah. So he basically, and the, the, the bar is padded right here, Brad. Mm, so yeah, basically, I hope and so. this does look obscene. I don't, well, there's no way to also. Well, of course. Well, that depends on <laughs> all the eye of the beholder. Yeah, well, I think they're all going to behold it. So you slide down like this, you take you know, pressure on. The, yep. And get a good posture. And you're basically going to do thrusts, hip thrusts. Oh. Yeah, I could see where that definitely works those glutes. Yeah, and, and supposedly, again, he's done multiple research projects on this, and this is the number one way to strengthen the glute. Sure. Now, I feel, especially if you dip way down, Brad, like yeah, this. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That's right. The big thing you have to do with all these exercises, you really want to squeeze the buttock together. Brad, what's your saying there? Oh, where you have... A quarter? Right. I mean, therapists have been teaching glute exercise like this for years, doing bridging, right. even in a hospital bed. And you say, well, to get the person to make sure they tighten their glutes maximally is imagine there's a quarter between your 
buttocks, cheeks, and you're trying to keep it there. Right. And boy, the things tighten up then. Yeah, that would do it. I um, mean, you got to have a sense of humor about yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. So It that, works. And people, the visual helps people. Mm -hmm. So uh, the other thing that I saw, this weighted bag, it's called the Garage Fit. And uh, we actually did a review on it on the Bob and Brad crew. Right. Yep. Uh, maybe we'll put a link on that list below. Yeah, there's and, a... uh You can put... You know, it's basically a heavy-duty bag that you can put sand in it, right? Well, there's sand bags in there that come with it. Oh, there is. I right. didn't know that. And they can vary the weight. Ah. Oh, yeah. It comes with up to a maximum of 75 uh, variable bags. You put them in one at a time. So this one has 75 five pounds on it with multiple handles. It's a nice option, so you don't have to buy a bar if you don't want to. Well, it's to. also, it seems like, to me, it'd be almost a little more comfortable. You know, going across yeah, your, your. I think groin. we should try it. We'll, we'll demonstrate I'll, that. I'll, let's. I'll I, try it flat. I don't have a problem with that. <laughs> All right, Brad, you gonna bring it over? Yep. So we're gonna do like bridging. If you're, you do this on a floor. Yeah, you do. You're this not on gonna a floor. do this on a bed. Now this would. Um, also, you're not getting quite the full range when you bridge from the floor. Sure. You know, you're not getting the. I can, I can feel that it's not working as hard mm -hmm. as if you would be leaning up against the bed, right. uh, bench. Um, I also think you can do it on a bed, to be honest with you. Yeah, leaning I suppose. I, I did it. I mean, I, it, it's, it actually worked pretty good. But you sink into so, the bed a little bit. Yeah. That's funny. I started to feel it. Oh, <laughs> it yeah. is working. Yeah. Brad, do you mind taking this off? Yeah. This is a nice... I mean, this is for the 30-year-old Yeah, guy. Yeah. Um, you can also do it with a kettlebell. You know, you can put oh, this yeah. on, on in, in place. I don't think we need to show that, Brad, do you? Uh, Down there? Uh, if you want to, go ahead. Well, you know, I mean, because these are this typically is, this young is, people or people are very active. Right. In, this is what a bench fit. height would be. It would be about this high. Right. So, you know, so you show could just it. take a good solid uh, stool at home, but you're going to need something cushy. We've got a Pete's Choice pad on it. It'd have to be really solid, Brad, though. I want to make sure nobody gets hurt here. Right. So. Yeah. Use your best judgment and I, do I it. I would say a bench. <laughs> All right, we yeah. won't show this. We're, yeah, we're, yeah, we're yeah, yeah, that's probably a good idea. I mean, I would do it, but I, yeah, I, I yeah. always live on the edge. Yeah, so the final thing is we're going to show you how to do it with the Bob and Brad wall anchor and bands. Yeah, and uh, this that, actually yeah. works quite well. Yeah, this does. It's uh, one of those things, if you don't you don't have to buy a bench, you don't have to Yeah, so you get the wall anchors and you get the, the bands and going to get in place here and i actually had to do the you know i start doing these yeah and i i have to you know you can't do them every day because it, it'll get sore so basically i'm grabbing my hands yep. my palms are forward and i'm lifting and squeezing yep. the butt look at this back posture that's critical you, you gotta yeah, keep you it. gotta really keep good posture yeah and then it's the same thing you cycle you out you're, squeezing yeah, you're the butt. thinking about squeezing those glutes together tight this will um, work yeah and this, uh, this one's in the book too, you said. Yeah, and also, you know, the thing is about this is as you get up here, the resistance gets worse. So, you know, it gets well, more. better. Better, yeah, better. More difficult. More difficult. Yeah, which is what you want because right. you, you have a better advantage at that right. point. Right, you're really squeezing away yeah. there. So. so so that's wonderful. So that's it. In a nutshell, Brad, uh, the one simple exercises uh, uh, we, we promised and we guaranteed and we delivered. All right, so that's going to help shape and form that gluteus maximus to what your yeah your, what your desires are exactly all right thanks for watching <laughs>